We traveled from Patras, Greece to Bari, Italy via overnight ferry for 13 hours. In the middle of the night, the ferry stopped at Igomenitsa, Greece and the island of Corfu. Alright, it's travel day. We have made it here. Check in for the passengers at the super ferry. Please uh, go down through that door uh, for embarkation. There will be a bus waiting to take us to the ship. We go to reception and get our keys. Super fast. I thought our backpacks were big. Yeah, everybody's got bigger backpacks than we do. <laughs> we got no reason to complain. Almost like a cruise ship. <laughs> Internet corner. Oh, it's nice and AC'd. Reception this way. Oh, look, they have a casino. No joke. Reception? No, I think that's dining. Yeah, a self service restaurant. Oh, so there is a restaurant, if you were wondering. There was places to eat. Oh, look at this, they got stuff you can buy things from. You're gonna have to do another whole trip in your office. Yeah. This might be reception. This is not reception. It's a bar. Stairs in the center, just like a cruise ship. Haha, <laughs> reception and a crystal lounge. This is oh, we're getting escorted. That's cool. Oh, more stairs. Yay. Oh, no spooning for us. <laughs> Cabin key, we get one. I got a desk for working. I want to see out the window. Open me the window, please. Whoa. Uh oh, we're on a deck where everybody can walk by. Shoot. No leaving it open the whole time. Yeah. There's life preservers in here and places to hang things. See, we have a shower, and wow, it looked like a shower. toilet somebody already peed in. Oh, it's green. <laughs> no, it's green. I think that's Odd the color, cleaning huh? solution. Probably. Of course it is. Oh, okay. Joking. Look at this. It's just kind of like one of the Airbnbs we had. Yeah. No, Two it's Airbnbs better though. than the Airbnb we had. I don't know if you're going to say that when the ship's rocking. I hope it's not rocking. <laughs> oh, no. You just made me want to take a pill. <laughs> we don't know. It's probably going to rock. Okay, I say we go try to find a way to get some food and how, figure out how this whole thing works. Yep, so we'll take video now before the ship gets busy, I guess, and go figure things out. Plus, we're hungry. We are in cabin 922A4. Okay, look, a map. We are. There's a Mike Kundos Lounge on this level. Cabin. 
Lounge Cabins. There's a Paris Lounge. Does that say nachos? Um, <laughs> okay. Sunset Veranda, Open Deck. Another okay. couple lounges. Okay, so the thing about it is if we did not buy a cabin at a few hundred dollars extra or whatever it was, we would have ended up having to sleep on the open deck. On the open deck. So I guess this is what that is. And let's go take a look at it. So f garages are five and under. So on this level, there's a couple lounges. And then the next level down, there's a, looks like. So we'll go up first, cause there's only this little piece right here to see. Then from here, we'll go down and go down and go down until oh, okay. there, okay? All right, let's do it. So this is when you don't have a room to sleep in. Here's one of the lounges. So they all have one TV. To watch. Yeah, they all have to share one TV. <laughs> and uh, they seem to recline pretty flat. I guess you just don't. Our room has a bed. These look like they recline into a bed. Somebody blew up a mattress down here. And um, you just have to get with everybody's snoring and you have no privacy. These people have done it before, they know. Yeah. And you have to share a bathroom. Oh, these ones look even less comfortable. Okay, so these are probably the base fare. Maybe you don't. Like first yeah, you don't get to recline in here. This is the Naxos Lounge, while the other one was the Michaels Lounge. And yeah, so basically this is like sleeping on a plane back here. There's four more lounges. So all these lounges I thought were going to be like places to eat. And <laughs> yeah, like they're and not. And so maybe it's some entertainment. Maybe the Crystal Lounge and the Central Lounges. Yeah. Maybe. But now we see how it's open. Yeah. So Deck 9 has the Mycos Lounge. Deck 8 has the Kalaminos Lounge. Anything in there? Cyrus Lounge, yeah. This is interesting. There it is, I think. In case we didn't tell you before, this is the ferry from um, Patra, Greece, Greece, to Bari, Italy. Italy. That's Some, Greece on the other side. Right somewhere there. down there. <laughs> oh, we can't go up to that level. They're keeping people off. Yep, of the so the top level's off limits. No going up there. I think our room is somewhere around here. Like, if we went down all I think way. I saw this lifeboat, so I think we're like right around here. Deck eight. Let's see what's going on. It's all rooms. No. Is this eight? This is eight. So there's gonna be some stuff up there. There's some empty space in there. Runners. It says right here too. Okay. Let's see if we can make our way back. This is the rooms in deck eight. At least it's AC'd. Yeah. Probably look cool up on the map. Icaria Lounge. 
Here's like some other lounge. And this is outdoor. Okay. So you can sit outdoors. It's like you can go upstairs from here. here. Café del Mare. <laughs> Holy. <laughs> no, you want one. Not too bad. Sandwiches, five year olds. Okay. Snacks, two year olds. Oh, this is a, this is a dining option here. Yeah, that's a little bit more. Okay. Let's go down to nine, eight. Let's go down to seven. And that's it. The rest of the process. So the casino's here, and all the other stuffs here. So. This is another place. I think this might be part of the cafe. Let's go look. Santorini. Yeah, that one. I guess you could hang out here if you don't want to go to your seat. Gamble the night away. Caesar salad. <laughs> bread. Well, they even charge you for bread and butter. Not very much though. 60 cents, 50 cents. Um, none of this is in English, so good luck to... Oh, actually some of them have. Yeah, here. there's both. So you, yeah, Greek first, and then oh, bake lamb with potatoes. That's a pretty cool dinner for fourteen dollars. I guess that's not steak and wine, fourteen dollars. Pork shank, pork steak. I go by picture as well. Milk-fed veal filet. Oh, it was a baby. Rice, pasta, they have desserts, wines, cheeses, salads, appetizers. Well, maybe we'll make our way back here later. Yeah. Oh, they have breakfast. Go. They have breakfast here. Do you have time something? No. Deck nine is where our cabin is and all those other lounges. Deck eight, all the lounges. Here we are on deck seven. The lounges and the restaurants are here. Oh, now there's a video games, a cinema, a shop. We saw. Let's try to find the junior cine. Oh, here's another restaurant. Is that the? No, this is the Agora. 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 So there's another restaurant too. We gotta find. There's also Silver Star. Okay. Wasn't that the other one? All the way in the, over there that you could choose the sandwiches. And that's a store. Sandwich or anything? Cookies, beers, refreshments, sandwiches. Got the same stuff. They got a real coffee though. So here's a silver star. Grease and every dish. Oh, this one's a fine, looks like fine dining. It's a a la carte. 
So These are care. better food right away. Look, did you look in there? They got tablecloths, yeah. wine glasses. So this is, uh, I guess they're high dining, high class dining restaurant on there. Oh, this is all Greek food. Yeah. Oh, that Some looks like pork chop. Pork chop. Free range chicken. Roasted lamb. Ribeye. Ooh, this place looks good. Maybe this is where we'll come for dinner. Oh, definitely. Oh, this is an espresso room. With a little, with a little menu. The restaurant opens at 6.30. 6.30. Hmm? Goodbye, Patras. Oh, Cafe Espresso. This is what we got for the menu. Pastry and sandwiches and snacks and ice cream and sweets and salads. Hmm. I like a refreshing lemon lime drink. They have milkshakes. And okay. Fred Osino's, what is that? Lurpy they have with lemon or strawberry flavor. So the question is, do we go on airplane mode when we leave the port? Or do we just not? Because if you don't do that on the cruise ship, they will charge you. How do they know who you are? Beats me. Anyway, back to other news. Scott got an ice cream. And I got this drink, lemon lime drink. While we wait, we should be leaving in about 12 minutes. Better get on the boat, everybody. Better hurry up.
just began. It just began. We have something like another eight or twelve hours on this thing, right? Yeah. There's a pet village. Maybe that's where you keep your pets. Here's a super fast ferry brochure. And there are some interesting things about this ship in here. Like you can travel with your pet, your family, special cabins for people who have breathing issues. You can camp on board. Showers, facilities, power supplies. Of course, you get a discount when you use your Euro Pass, which is what we did. We got the dining carts. It does say that they give you free Wi Fi. Is it free for you so far? Um, I was able to get free Wi Fi, but let's see if I can check my email. Okay. So if not, they say you can purchase internet packages. Look, it, uh, yeah. yeah, emails so are coming in. Free Wi-Fi, that's awesome. And then they have all the schedules in here. And of course, if you book early, you get 20% off and all these other discounts, RVs and whatnot. This is a pretty cool way to travel. It's like um, a cruise ship, but on a really smaller scale. What's cool about the free Wi-Fi is they get all these little things in there like to tell you what's being served at the different restaurants and here's this one is my favorite vessel position. So we're right here right now. We want to go to Bari which is right there and uh, we can watch our progress. It doesn't tell us what time though it arrives I think at 9 a.m. tomorrow. But at least I can, I can go someplace to watch where we are. And then so that little sign down there tells us that uh, during different points, which is Bari's at 9:30 a.m. and 1 a.m. we're gonna hit, we're gonna be at Corfu, and then uh, like at 11:30 p.m. So like an hour and a half before that, we're gonna be at this place. I can't read it because my eyes equal yeah. mints. Uh, mints. Right. Well, so we're gonna stop at those places along the way. I think we're gonna pick up people. Maybe and vehicles, or maybe drop off people and drop oh, off vehicles. Yeah, cool. Okay. And we're still waiting. The dining room opens up in <coughs> six minutes. Six minutes. So all together, this ride will be from 5:30 to 9:30 in the morning. 5.30 p.m. to 9.30. How many hours is that? So that's um, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 hours. 16 hours we're going to be on this ship. Yeah, that's, that's quite a quite We'll a be time. sleeping for a lot of it. Whew, that's a long time. So this is probably why people <clears throat> opt to fly because it would be a lot faster. But, um, you know, us, we're trying to go as cheap as we can. Even though time is money. Yeah, but also it's this just, is fun. This was interesting to try a different way to get somewhere. Yeah. Like we're taking trains all the time, so that's totally different. We've never really done that before. So, trains, planes, and automobiles, and both. Yeah. <laughs> so we've got to do it all, right? That's right. Okay, so as a wrap up, you saw you really can't get down to the garage once it's done loading. So there's only about three decks that you can do anything on the ship, and we've showed you everything. And we didn't find any other showers. Yeah. So I think they don't have showers. Right. Although that article did say it was something for about campers, so maybe it's down here where the campers are, I don't know. But um, yeah, that's it, and there's only about <laughs> maybe 50 people on this whole ship that looks like it carries a thousand people <laughs> right I mean yeah. look at all those seats they're basically all empty yeah. so. it's like 
we're on a ghost ship. There's a couple people per, and that's it. And just us, we might even be the only ones at the dining room. Yeah. This could be scary, I guess. <laughs> Italy, you're supposed to order two things. What, is your appetizer? No, an appetizer and then a main dish. Oh, okay. They have a third course called the second main, but you don't have to get that. Okay, so this is the menu again. Scott thinks it's changed, so oh, we're gonna get an appetizer. There's a salad, pasta, soups, main dishes, and desserts. We should get the steamed mussels. Yeah, or grilled octopus, or grilled mushrooms. Ooh. Crispy codfish looks good to me too. And what are you getting for your main dish? I'm gonna get this Greek moussaka because it's cooked in a clay pot. Okay. Well, I think I will get a pork chop with orange zest, thyme, and mustard sauce. That looks good to me. Sounds good. Roasted lamb looks good too. I just hope they don't overcook the pork chop. You can ask about it. Maybe this is an open hand. There's nobody here. There's nobody here. We found somebody. And we're also the only one here. Thanks. We're on a ghost ship by ourselves. They're like, who would eat here? You're crazy. What'd you say? <laughs> I said, let's take our time eating. We're stuck on this boat for another 14 hours. Muscles. Teddy was just complaining that she needed to get stronger, so muscles. here's some muscles. Those are muscles. <laughs> These are muscles. <laughs> <laughs> well, they say oh, if you, you eat muscles, muscles then you get stronger. If you eat brains, then you get smarter. No thanks. I'm a brain. They're brain big. Smarter. I like the little ones. taste one and see what they taste like yeah I'm the cameraman you're the actor it smells citrusy it's not that this is the first time I've ever had mussels Like them? Or? I would rather be without cheese because I'm just used to things not having cheese in it, at least by seafood. But it's not a bad flavor. It's new. It's something new. New. This is new. This one doesn't have cheese. So we'll eat the cheese. Mm. Eat that cheese with it. It had cheese flavor. I prefer like Tom's way <laughs> with the garlic sauce. That's what I just yeah. what I just said. I said without and cheese is how I like my other flavors too. And it, it tastes not for some reason that thing's not fresh to me. They're pretty big. Maybe these bigger ones aren't as good as the little ones. So do you not like? Uh, they're okay, but I'd rather have the ones in Washington. I just rather have the ones that have come with garlic sauce yeah. and nothing garlic else. Wine. Yeah, and nothing else. No cheese, no nothing else. Yeah. yeah. That's not that we always do. Oosaka. Oosaka. Here's my pork 
chop. It's literally just a pork chop. But they but gave you us got all some these sides. things. Those yeah. are for you. Yeah, all these sides are mine. Something smells good. So I don't know what it is. Go ahead. Give it to me. Give it to my baby. This is something that you can eat slowly. Chop it all up. I want to see inside. <laughs> what? There you got some meat. And you got oh. some cheese. Osaka. And remember it has a uh, eggplant in it. It smells a little bit like a Indian dish. It's got like Indian spices. Probably has ricotta cheese in there too. <laughs> it's good. Is it better than the other one? That you had? It tastes Greece. like um, Athens. Cinnamon Toast Crunch mixed up with like a uh, shepherd's pie. Josh. <laughs> yeah, it does. Really? Yeah. Is it better than the ones you had in Athens? No, I don't think so. Mm. Those were better, but it's still good. Okay. Let's see what yours is like. I don't know. Moment of truth is to see if Mine it's tender or not. Dry. But I could make this at home. Yeah. No. Maybe it'll taste really good. looking ones but these don't look cool here I'm gonna try this you have to find one that doesn't make noise okay. well I just had a shower and now I'm in this uh, comfortable little bed by myself. Got over there. Just taking a shower right now though. This is a lot like camping. So it's kind of fun. Um, glad that we were able to have a shower. The people who don't have rooms still have that luxury. And those seats as you saw aren't that comfortable even though they somewhat recline flat. So we get to sleep on a flat bed tonight and have a shower so it's pretty nice and you know sleep how we want we don't have to worry about uh, anything anybody going through our luggages or our backpacks or anything like that they're all secure here in the room with us and uh, you know you can be comfortable you don't have to you know wear, worry about what you're wearing you can wear what you like or nothing at all but this is our room see you in the morning We're here at Bari. Oh. 
They even put big trucks on there, as well as people's passenger vehicles. This reminds me of the super ferry Hawaii used to have. It was a great thing. You know, being able to go from island to island and bring your car. Some kind of castle. We're walking through the train station right now. This port is probably the closest I'm gonna get to Sicily, which is actually where my Italian comes from. There's the castle, and we're going through this tunnel. And they got birds there. This must be a pet shop. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Trail bike. It smells nice here, like fresh laundry. <laughs> I'm not 100% we're going in the right direction. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Pretty house, or good house. This is the Italian Superman. He's built like me with short legs. <laughs> Mincusi. I don't know what that is. Apartments, I guess. Clothing store at the bottom. I don't know. I guess they love our music here too. <laughs> Terra di Bari. There's a nice little park right before you get to the train station. University. And we found this place where we can keep our bags, you know, relatively near us and safe. And this will be our first shot at Italian food. So, here's what their menu looks like. The price is not so bad. About $10 a pizza. Well, is a nice air conditioning table. Yeah, it's worth a lot. Whatever price they got. Alright, so I'll get back to you in a second when I figure out what we want to eat. Okay, so far we're going to share the meatballs. Casillo and Pepe, and two cappuccinos, a water, and maybe a Coke. It's really different? Yeah. Oh wow. It's good. Is it different in a good way? Oh yeah, yeah. It's more like a, a hot milkshake. If you can imagine that. Like oh wow. Thicker That's thicker. nuts. Now, there it is. You're Italian, not me. I'm Italian. Uh, Hard Italian. Oh. 
Oh, you're making excuses already. I'm part Italian. This is the food of my loins. Flavor packed in a little punch. Yeah. Okay, we ended up getting a pistachio dessert. It's cream cheese in the middle. Oh, I love it. Okay, you're gonna like this. <laughs> That's my Italian people. Yeah, you're gonna like it. And you don't. Cause you I don't know. Like it. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Alright, lady. What do you think? I like it. Yeah, you can have it all. I'll have a little bit of it, but I'd rather have this. <laughs> Finally reached the train station. Now, a four hour ride to Rome. Yeah, next up, Rome. <laughs> 